Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. It's me, S Chassis Supreme, and we finally got the update. And PC got it, I think, a month back. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think they got it like a month back or something like that. But they only had two maps night mode. I th I'm pretty sure the reason that they didn't release it for console at the same time is because they were still trying to figure out how to get night mode for all maps. So, today, this, it sounded like I was making like an update video, but no, nah, there's still a tune video. So, we're going to be tuning the Nissan Stega, also known as the Unicorn in-game. <clears throat> now, let's go over it. So, ultimate, as always, and so front spring length is going to be two centimeters. Uh front spring stiffness and rear spring stiffness is going to be 30 so the lowest possible front and rear shock stiffness 50 front toe 0 rear toe 10 0 0.10 positive or as close as possible as you can get to those two front camber is negative 5.54 rear camber is negative 4.52 front and rear anti roll bar that is both 150. Caster, max it out as always. Just steering angle, max that out too. I don't know why you wouldn't. Ackerman, don't max that out. But put it at 20. R front rim diameter, 19. Rear rim diameter, 19. Front and rear tire width, 325s. Front and rear tire pressure, 100. Front and rear wheel adhesion, 120. Front wheel track, Positive 2, rear base, negative 1, front and rear tire profile, 20, two. everything in engine, max it out, diff locking, max that out, and lower the final drive to 3.7, because the 4.9 it was was way too fast for actual good gearing, but all the rest of the gears are stock though, it's just the final drive, it's really all I needed to change. Brake torque, max that out. Brake bias, max that out. ABS, you don't want that. And now let's hop into a... Will night mode work for... Ah, so night mode does work. Now let's hop into... Castle Road. Alright, so we're here in Castle Road. And... It looks so beautiful. Night mode's actually the best thing that's ever happened to us in Car X. And as you can see, this is a, also a stance tune. So don't hit, don't really hit bumps at like 200 miles an hour. And also I might get a thumbnail right here. Nah. Oh. Obviously I'm on ice and we don't have winter tires on this map, so Which is kind of weird how we don't have winter tires on this map. But yeah, as you can see, the game looks so beautiful. This uh, they updated the graphics too, so the game just looks 20 times that much better. Oh, uh. <laughs> so the problem is, <laughs> the problem is we flipped over. But uh, yeah, this tune is actually really good. Believe it or not. <laughs> Dang, I was trying to get a thumbnail. Oh, my dog's gonna start wiping his face on the ground. But yeah, let's go into an actual map that isn't w snowy. Yeah, I'm also making this at uh, 6.42 in the morning. So, I'm a little bit tired. And my dog just woke up. 
because he wakes up really early. So, yeah, let's hop into that other lobby on East Toge. Alright, uh -oh. Alright, so we're here in East Toge. Now, this tune is actually really good. Let me turn smoke on because I'm not tanning with anybody. And you guys also need to see how beautiful the game looks with the smoke at night. So, this tune is a stance tune. So it's not going to handle bumps the best. It's, a, it's like a stance drift missile. So, it's a good drift car. But when it comes to like, huge bumps and stuff. That was a little bit of oversteer. That was bad. So yeah, this is a, it's not, it doesn't perform like all my other tunes. This is not meant to just the best. This is meant to feel like you're actually in control of the car. I was looking at my timer. It's meant to feel like you're actually in control of the car, so whatever happens to it, it's your fault, not the car's. You know what I mean? So, it's tuned. This is tuned specifically for that. It's not like driving assists with all my other tunes. Oh, that was sick. But yeah, the game just looks overall way better with the new graphics and night mode. Oh, I'm gonna do like, I'm gonna do a uh, jump in first person. Actually, no. That uh, guy's, that'll make you guys nauseous, especially if I fail. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna torture you like that. But I have tunes for the R34 coming soon, the Eleganto and the Corona. But yeah, those tunes are coming soon. I might record them later today. Because today is Saturday still. And when I am gonna probably make the record the tune videos, it's also gonna be like later in the day of Saturday. Not hella or early in the morning like this. But yeah. This is going to be the first tune of the day. With the new update. And. Thumbnail jump drift right here. Hopefully. Oh yeah this is it. Um, hold up. Nah, that's not it. Alright, so, ultimate, as always, let's get into it. Front and rear, or front suspension length is 19 centimeters, and rear is 18. Front and rear spring stiffness is 30. Front and rear shock stiffness, 50. Toes, front toe is zero flat out, all. And rear toe is 0 0.1. Front camber, negative 3.25. Rear camber, negative 1.66. Front and rear anti-roll bar is 150. Caster, 10, 61 degrees for max steering angle, so max that. Ackerman, 15. Front and rear rim diameter is 19. Front and rear tire width is 325. Front and rear tire pressure is 100. Front and rear wheel adhesion on 20. Front wheel track, 3. Rear base, 0. Or positive 3, actually, too. Um, front and rear tire profile, 20. Uh, engine, max it all out. Transmission, diff locking that at one final drive 
3.2, so 320. Brakes, brake torque, and brake bias. Max those two out. ABS off, and launch control off. And now, let's hop into it. Mm, East Toge or a different map? Oh no. I'm gonna go with nighttime East Toge. I love nighttime, by the way. Also, if you want me to do any other maps for uh, the Toon Showcases, just let me know in the comments. Alright? Just let me know which what map you want me to do the next Toon video on. Or for the testing. And to give an example, just let me know. Uh, but for now, I'm gonna stay on East Toge. Alright, so this tune is super smooth and it has really soft suspension too. Alright, so yeah. East Toga. Alright, so yeah, this tune is super smooth. Soft suspension. It can hold angle and it can also handle the jump drift pretty well unless you do that they need to fix that wall like really they need to fix all the walls in this game to be honest and tryouts gonna be on the Friday of Christmas week Make sure to you be there. Or set a reminder or something. Set a reminder for that. And yeah. Tryouts Friday of Christmas week. Now let's hop on the FD map. Alright, so we're here in West Coast Arena. And yeah, let's get it. Alright, so. And then initiate. As you can guide. As you were seeing, this tune is really smooth around this track. Unless you do what everyone does and hits the wall. Let's see. It's not that bad. Now pretend you're a uh, chaser, right? Alright. Uh, never mind. Don't pretend you're a chaser because this is lead run right here. Oh, yeah. This is lead. See, I can run some clean lines on this. Jesus. God, that was beautiful. Alright, now I'm gonna go get the tandem run. Alright, so we're here in tandems. And let's do it. So I'm setting the lead run right now. See, it went super smooth. I don't think I got that one. Oh, that was terrible. But yeah, let's get the um, chase in.
Now I'm not that close to myself. Wow. I'm in the dirt. 